Yeah. Welcome back. Let's get this shit done. Then. They're dilly dallying. No dilly dallying is right. That's the name of this episode. Dilly dallying, motherfuckers. Yeah. <laughs> At dawn we plan. You don't, you don't have to put motherfuckers in there, but I still suggest it. The one where Rand's asleep. <laughs> the one where Rand's always asleep. Rand's gonna All be asleep right. for the rest of this dungeon. Excluding one boulder, how smooth is this going? Huh? Excluding one boulder, how smooth is this, smooth is this going? Well, very smoothly. He did no. say he was expediting this. Yeah. And you search I mean, Rand. through... <laughs> That's in character, by the way. <laughs> this room... Yes? Okay. This... This area up here, we won't bother with the the minis for like this next part. This room was just holding like a, a spring loaded the boulder trap area for the boulder. Spring loaded boulder trap. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. D and D stuff. So we got the we got the we got the earth ring. So yes. How many rings for? We only need it for it. Yes, to open the next door. Cool. Uh, now. <coughs> This room is filled, it's like a camping area almost. Like there's, there's no smell emerges from this room. There's no rubble on the floor, blankets, water flasks, and an iron stove. Give the room an almost homey look. With light, this room might even be inviting and warm. And there's actually no one in it. It's just a big room that's full of like camping supplies and a cooking stove. Um, it's all got like super thick dust on it because no one's been in here for a very long time. So no one's probably coming back. <coughs> no. No, no. So, um, I'm just checking on any of that. Yeah, we're good there. Hmm? No worries there. 17. 117. Which is this room? <clears throat> um, there's a door, obviously, and it's it is it's it's locked. It's heavy oaken door, and it's uh, actually very sturdy, even though there is dust on it. Like this area has been so long disused that, that there's actually a little bit of dust clinging to the walls and stuff. Like when you touch the wall, yeah. you can write. Yeah. Wash me. Wash me. <laughs> Fuck Rand. Uh, <clears throat> Kilroy was here. Huh? Kilroy was here. <gasps> and from the from the other side of the door, there is a um, soft scratching noise. Almost sounds like like skeletons or rats or something along those lines. Something is like scratching at the door. Cat wants out. God damn it. <laughs> well, when we open the door, it's not gonna come out. Meow. Yeah. You wanna go inside. Or outside. Or inside. Or outside. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's really good. Um a uh, as you kind of Investigate the door more thoroughly. Kind of find out, find out that it is locked. There is a scream is emitted from within the room. Wait, there's a, a scream comes from the inside. He's gonna want to knock down the door. At least have us unlock it. He's I'll knock down the door. I head down. I head to the door. <laughs> he knocks down the door. Do not knock down the door. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna look for trouble. <laughs> Do not kick down the door. It's okay, cause I'm gonna loot the room. I can <laughs> unlock this. Actually, yeah, he's got a point. Like, All right. This is the game. Right. Okay. I draw my weapon and I ready it. Might as well do the same. Uh, I'll <laughs> put him in front of the door. Uh. That, that door, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm going to stay where I'm at. Well, I'm going to move over here a little bit. He's going to mage hand that. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to mage hand. Mage hand, the door. legend, remain. Oh, I don't stand directly in front of the door. Let me just, <laughs> let me just make that abundantly clear. That's fair. Sure, I just don't. put you over there. I mean, my bow's out, but you I step back a bit. <laughs> yeah, I I stand a good distance Wait, away, but I'm ready. Is the other door directly in. across from it? Yes. Can I step into that room then? Yeah. Have bow out and whatnot. <laughs> it's dark in there. Yeah. I can um, see the dark. So You're to be I attempt to unlock the door. <laughs> I, I'm really astounded at your inability to hit that. 
you hear um, after the scream there is a whisper come from within That's the not room. Creepy at all. It says what? Soaring. Neat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, uh. Yeah. <laughs> like so everybody hears have, it. If you didn't have your weapon cool. out before, now you definitely have your weapon out. I have my brown pants on. <laughs> <laughs> Well, anyway. What did you roll? I rolled a 9, so 23. Jesus fuck. Remember. The gloves. I know. The gloves it's of, of Actually, no, of 22. Thievery, sorry. Uh, I have a fucking amazing. What are they? Well, plus what? The glove with pit pocket, plus I have an 8 in sleight of hand. So that's 13 added to the 9. That'll work. Mm hmm. That'll do, pig. That'll do, pig. That's why I go to unlock doors. <laughs> yeah, okay. So the door unlocks. And before anyone can actually open the door, it, it like, is flung open. Okay. And you, like, you can't see inside this room, even with dark vision. It's the darkness it's spells inside the room. It's pitch black. Pitch black. And a, uh, a tendril of the darkness shoots out. Of Can the we room. Really attack the darkness? And <laughs> veers and know. like Zara, Zara, you, Zara, you see this, this, this dark, Trailer. like this, this dark tendril, like shoot out, but it goes like around your head and like over your shoulder, and it's going to, um, Good. Soren, like just hit Soren. <laughs> <Ow>. <laughs> Um, but there's no damage. You just feel uh, this 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 really bizarre touch of of shadow. It's that there's not really any way to sufficiently describe it. And it's like when you sit on your leg too long. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it! The fuck. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> we'll go with that. <laughs> it's a really weird feeling. And you hear a voice, and this is just inside your head now. Uh, welcome, my shadow hunter. Neat. And then, actually, like the shadow tendril will like pull back in, and the and the door slam shut. <laughs> so, yeah, interesting. We have a new class. I, I noticed I that he had a you had a thingy there. Yes, yeah. Soren Soren is now going to be multiclassing into Shadow Hunter. Is a homebrew that I found, but I really like. She's a homebrew that's super neat. I need to look into some other homebrews. There's a wiki. I know there's a wiki. I want to take Rogue 10, but after that, I don't really care about Rogue. I want to multi-class. You're probably going to need a multi-class in the Barbarian. <laughs> that's actually... <laughs> like, yeah. yeah. You can focus the would, rage. That would actually That's help not a bad... Yeah. You should, you should go hunt down I need her. to look into Barbarian. That will allow you to channel the rage. Are we going to have a halfling barbarian? <laughs> a halfling That's a rogue awesome. barbarian. So a barbarian who can rage and have sneak attack. Holy fuck. <laughs> Shit. If he classes into barbarian, he might eventually learn to control it. Well, okay. right now I don't have the strength to use, go barbarian. True, you would have to build your strength yeah. up. Give it time. Yeah. There are items, too. I can help with yeah. that. Yeah. Would, would he end up being something akin to a whirling dervish, basically? Because I've seen a Dex Barbarian before. Sort of. I'd have to look into... I don't even Meat. know what barbs do, like there what their class mm -hmm. archetype choices are. Probably. Yeah. Uh, you don't know what that's going to mean down the road? I wanted to leave a scar, because it's actually supposed to. Cool. Um, okay. So it leaves face. a scar Across on your, your face. eye. Mm -hmm. I that thought is, you were ugly before. But it's not a natural scar. It's supposed to be like a. 
It's black. Yeah. Like, it's a black. It's not normal. Yeah. <laughs> That's cool. You guys are looking so awesome from from this dungeon. You got the like badass like black He's got this scar. You got cool the black eyes. Eyes. thing. Yeah, I've I've got. And you got your a hell black eyes. eyes. All right. Yeah. <laughs> now you we're gonna be HP we're gonna be this. terrifying when we actually get to. This Gary is Rock. all this this place good. Is you see did this is question? Did any of you want to actually look in this room? To no one actually went into this room. Like a nice. It just it just came out and you killed it and then. Um, sure, why not? Yeah, let's look into it. I uh, can I use my? This is a dumb question. I agree. Should have thought of this. Can my lantern simply illuminate things? <laughs> I never really specified that. It does everything except actually light things. <laughs> yes, it can. Okay. Well, I encourage it to glow and. I leave this inside, filling the room with light. What color? Oh, let's see. That's a good question. Something pretty. Um, a white I, light. I was saying, I sure truth. White lines. light. Okay. Going standard. I can dig it. Yeah, for now. Illumination. That's the best light for your um, power armor in Fallout. In Fallout Four. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. So everyone's gonna go. I guess you're leading the way. Are you going through the door or through the hole? Uh, let's go through the hole. Why not? Okay. Anyone else going in? Lisa. Yeah, absolutely. Lisa's uh, gonna go I, in. I want to walk in quietly when I walk in. I'm not gonna talk very much. Right. So any talking I do is not in character. You're probably a little freaked out. In character. This guy's gone. Okay. So in this room, of course, are the remains of a lot of vials. Like, there's shards of glass all over the floor. Bark is not going in this room. Yes. <laughs> uh, for obvious reasons. I need everyone to... Um, okay. The front, or rather, the, the outside of the room. Let me get the camera so you guys can see. Uh, okay, so like along the walls and on the interior, sort of middle of the room, there were tables all over the place. Many of them have actually been burned and crushed by the alchemical golem. Uh, there are a few intact. This, the, the far corner is actually more or less intact. There's not really anything of particular value that is on the tables, but you you could collect some like empty vials and things like that if you wanted to for future collecting purposes, if you so chose. And I believe Leas will actually do that. Just gonna get some. What's he collecting? Containers, vials. like vials, empty vials. All right. There's a table that has empty vials on it. I haven't worked. I haven't been really been working on my alchemy. I'm more uh, academic. So. Uh, we're doing. Say he's gonna grab ten vials. Who knows? Who knows what that'll be useful for? I'm sure, there'll be something that will come along. And on the far table. Where some of these, these these empty vials are, there is a note. Um, I pick it up and read it. I say a note. Is that a note? What is that? Carried the hammer in No, it's 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 in the book. I'm okay. just am trying to find the. Uh, oh, you can't read their handwriting. Well, no. I'm just trying to think to see if it's a note or like a diary. It's a diary. Okay. Um, okay, I more carefully pick it up if it's closed. Yeah. <laughs> the the <laughs> yeah the the tattered remains of a diary no, are I found. Though most of the diary is too cracked and stained to read, a few entries can be made out. Um, it's not trapped. It's just a book. It's okay. like a notebook. I read it. A notebook. I'll okay. Try that I'm up to no good. Dot dot dot. So like, there's like a bunch of smudges and stuff, and then you start to to have some text. Uh, what happened here? Period. Uh, there's like text before that, of course. We were on patrol for no more than a week, so whatever it was happened suddenly. Dame 
Ariane, or Ar Ariane, ugh, believed firmly that the straggler we found, Gynok Moltor, is somehow responsible. Though I... And then you can't read anywhere past that. And then, like, several more pages are illegible. And then you start to see some more readable text. There's some text. Have, have, have seen the traitor. May vengeance sear his bones. We are too few to retake our stronghold, for he now rules an army of demons, we'll say, uh, larger than any I have seen before. The creatures do not enter the east entryway often, for earthquakes have filled much of the hallway with rubble. Those few who do come here never enter the foyer of the hidden entrance to the eastern slopes. Foyer, whatever. Uh, yes, right. Foyer. Foyer. So, perhaps the last stand our brethren made here kept the evil that now pervades this place from their burial ground. I hope this is so for the sake of their souls. The few of us are left. We clearly must try to bring Motor to justice. A few of us shall head to Freeport. Freeport, which is some other town, really. I'll come up with a different name for that later. Uh, probably Ganrock. Uh, to begin building a stronger base there. The rest are going with me to the lower levels in search of more unreadable pages. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, they're looking for more unreadable pages. Yeah. Yeah. And then, towards the end of it... <laughs> they got me towards the end of it, there's kind of a final thing here. Um, all dead. <coughs> Drums in the deep. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> they are coming. No. Uh, some rose again to strike at the living. I alone remain, once again, making a final stand in this room. I have set up a trap for anything that may come in. Hopefully it will be enough. The demons stir. Someone is coming, and like Trump. you didn't, <laughs> you didn't notice it before, uh, but kind of like near the table, covered covered in dust, is a badly mangled skeleton. Five fools. And give me perception checks. I don't know what that is. No. Thirteen. Twelve. <coughs> Perception. Sorry. Oof. Jackie texting. Uh, utter failure. Um, <coughs> eight. Okay. <laughs> Zara is distracted by the book. So eight, and then... Thirteen. Thirteen, and you said twelve? Okay. Let's see what Leah gets. It's not terrible. Except he gets no bonus. Okay. Right. Um, so, behind the table where you find the diary, you see that there are, in the wall itself, there are some, like, chunks missing out of it almost. Mm -hmm. And it seems like it opens, like, it's like a secret area. Uh, but because of the age and that it, it's been kind of jacked up in here due to the recent explosions and stuff, um, there, are, there are holes and you can kind of see that there is some kind of space behind the wall, behind the table. Do with that as you will. Well, I didn't see it because... Yeah. <laughs> you do with it as you will. Chiron, Chiron you see it and uh, Leas will also still kind of move everybody in here. Okay, what is it again? Stepping gently. There's this ruined There's, secret doorway. Yeah. Secret tunnel. There's a wall that has holes in it. From, secret tunnel. From, from the stuff that happened. And you can kind of see that it leads further in to some kind of um, carved, carved, hollowed out hollow hallway. 
crawl space almost. Okay. How's that nap going? Going great. Man. Refreshing. <laughs> to say the least. Could y'all clear a path? Between the shattered glass, the bark, he doesn't, he has sensitive paws. Mm, he'll be fine. <laughs> Trouble is, assuming uh, that you kind of clear clear the way a bit, you see about. Uh, oh, wow. This marker. Oh, I thought they were just going for the minis. No, we have to find a marker now. <laughs> <laughs> Probably about 25, 30 feet in. It's like that chalk zone kid. There's a. There's a pretty nasty cave in. Rudy? I can't remember. I love chalk sound though. The kid's name was Rudy. Okay. Because Rudy had the chalk. There's yeah. a cave in where that is. Chalk, the chalk, the chalk sound. Yeah. Rudy's got the chalk. There's a cave in about. I'm not showing it. Yeah, there we go. Right here. So it does go a little ways in, and you think it probably did go further than that. But it's kind of it's 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 kind of caved in. So this is a waste of our time. Well, no, you find within the cave in there's um, there's a hand sticking out from under the rubble. It's all skeletal and gross. And there is a uh, it has a ring. What's the ring look like? On its finger. Like not one of our big rings, but. A regular, right, like, okay. like a regular, right. regular ring. It looks like say so that it has an obsidian stone and is a it has a silver band and obsidian stone. So that's what we see. He taking out of the rubble. Yeah, like this dude got crushed by the cave okay. in, and his hand is sticking out. I take it. He went to Jared's. <laughs> I take it. Okay. I may chant it. It's not. I take it. Okay. I'll so write that down. Off. Obsidian ring? Do you put it Obsidian on? Obsidian ring, yeah. No, he doesn't put it on. It's stupid. I don't no, know. Space don't for things. You're asleep. Go away. You're asleep. Go away. <laughs> now. As I take it, I laugh really hard. <laughs> and shake the hand. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> nice and more, but I don't like it. It shakes back. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. So this area is essentially done. Okay. This part. Murder everything, done. then. <laughs> the 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 final uh, process yeah, is actually yeah. to get to the door. The four ring door. Ba -na -na. The four ring door. Ba -na -na -na. It's like the four plate door. Where the hell is it? Which is there? Where is it? Is it this one? Yeah. All right. All right there. Can we walk back there without you know, have to deal with anything? Yeah. Well, you killed everything. Ah! You've been my game before. Come on. <laughs> Can't get enough of that there. <laughs> what? You being... <laughs> Unconscious. <laughs> The fact that with the way this looks, it looks like you got a D8 shoved, or yep, a D1 shoved in your ass. <laughs> that's his front. A oh yeah, that's the front. What is a D1? It's Jesse I mean, being really fucking <laughs> tired, you fucking prick. This is a D1. Yeah. You know what? This is a D1. <laughs> Roll a D1. D See what you get. Because it's a reflex. I got a two. Because you get it every time. <laughs> roll it, watch what happens. There it is. <laughs> Alright, so... Uh... If you do this, you didn't roll D1. Does anyone he rolled want a D9. to do any kind of resting for? We you probably continue? should rested. I could probably, probably use a rest. We probably should have rested in that lovely room back there that was designed for resting. You can oh, do that. Well. You want to do long rest? It would make sense for the people that are hurt. True. Okay. This is then they will give him a chance to wake up. This is me not talking in character. This is me talking out of character. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So before you do this, you spend a bit in. This room, taking a long rest. I want to spend the entire time staring into a corner. Okay. I'm okay. Sitting in the floor. Yeah. Um, anyway. You read this, by the way, didn't you, Joe? Mm hmm. Did you read this? Not. Anyways. Offhand, but it, it's good. 
Uh, one other thing about that whole shadow experience that you had is that... Which, thank you all for reacting and all. Hmm. I said neat. Yeah. You are, of course, the only one who would notice this or feel this, but like you feel some of the shadow magic that courses through you pass into the ornamental dagger that you took. Cool. Cool, cool. We'll see. That's why it has a star on it. We'll see what what that does later. That's an uh, dagger. Long rest, like everyone's you back to full health. Yay. And Real regains quick. any spells that are that were spent. Am so I awake? You are now awake. Yay! What happened? Gosh! Did I drink the right potion? No. No? No. I had to use half my sleep spores on you. <laughs> oh! You tried to kill us. Shit! Rand. What happened to your face? I was right. Hey, Rand, do you I have a mirror? Right, Rand. <laughs> what? What? What the fuck happened to. And what's the. Ah! <laughs> Thank you. Like, Rand's like freaking the <laughs> Fuck out right now. Oh. What did you? What the? F and immediately he like turns the sword. What the fuck did you do to me? Like he just assumes you did something to it. I was right. He was right. What the fuck went on? I was right. Hey, Matt. Hmm. Are you wearing a cloak? Yes. You are wearing That's a cloak. A shirt. Okay. What does your cloak do? Keeps him warm. <laughs> Keeps you warm? Okay. <coughs> so now it's in character time. Hey, Zara. Yes. Have this gift. It's oh. a mantle of spell protection. It's oh. present. Spell Thank resistance. You. Present for Zara. You have not turned on me yet, so. <laughs> <laughs> we'll see. Like Are you it. wearing a different cloak? I'm wearing a cloak of protection. It gives me a plus, a plus one to my AC. I yes. wake up. What's He's the mantle the... spell resistance do? Uh, you get advantage on any spell checks against you. That's nice. So anything that casts a spell against you, Tank you get... Thanks, Zara. It's a present for Zara. Thank you. So you got this. should help. Cool. Do not Star betray my thing. trust. He's got giant freaking glow... His lantern's even more glowy. I've got demon eyes, and I don't know what the my fuck's going on. My lantern is still already half of a demon. I'm already a demon. There, I, but I, you I'm don't have anything during, new during yet. That night. yet. Yeah. Uh -huh. I'm going to look when, into these homebrews. When you're sleeping and focusing on the lantern, uh, you start to hear... Uh, it's, it's, it's noticeably Yay. more, I guess, self-aware than it than it's it was before. Uh -huh. um, the master didn't tell me about this. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You you've absorbed a lot of Artec into it. Oh. Artec is I have a lot of GP. Is is this happening while we're taking the rest? Yeah. So is he asleep realizing this, or is he awake? Realizing this? He is uh, be. during well, the spell for prep for preparation yeah. area. Do you like, have a name? You have to no. sleep. Uh, it's the know. lantern of the village. Yeah. That's just what it's supposed to be called, but it doesn't have a proper name. There are some that call it Tim, <laughs> and, and and it sounds like a lot of different voices at the same time. Mm -hmm. It's. it's it's creepy, but in a way that you're actually probably reasonably comfortable with. It's a comforting sound. You're in a weird, you're, creepy way. You're a necromancer, yeah. Um, we will be right back in a moment. Later! <laughs> 